Hi everyone, you are watching Ganesandra program on my YouTube channel Infinity minus Infinity. So today I am going to discuss how to find out a square root of a number very easily. Okay, we know that uh, finding the square root of a number little difficult uh, using multiplication. But uh, using this shortcut method you can find the answer within second. Okay, so before going to the shortcut method, uh, we have to study some groups. Centered. So I have written some groups here, 1 square, 9 square, 1 group. 2 square, 8 square, another group, 3 square, 7 square, 4 square, 6 square and 5 square. So, these groups you have to study it. Because uh, in that groups, 1 square, 9 square, 1 square is 1, 9 square is 81, unit place is 1. So, 1, 1, unit place 1, 1. Next, 2 square, 8 square, 2 square, 4, 8 square, 64, unit place 4, 4, same numbers. 3 square 9, 7 square 49, so 9, 9, unit to place 9, 9, 4 square 6 square, unit to place 6, 6, 5 square 25, there is no other option, just one uh, number only, 5 square is equal to 25. So these are the sum groups. So these groups you have to study it properly, then only you can do the problem, otherwise then only you can find the square root of numbers very easily. Send it a very easy trick it is for finding the square root of any number. Send it. So 1, 9, 2, 8, 3, 7, 4, 6 and 5. These are the groups. For what we are using this group while doing the problem, you will get the idea. Okay, we can start with the first question. That is a square root of 1764 we have to find out. So first step, if you are finding the square root of any number, first step, you have to make the groups like this way. First two digit remaining numbers. Like that way, I have to make the groups. First two digit numbers, send it to first two digits, unit place and tens place in one group and remaining numbers in another group. Like that way, I have to make it. So that group should be there. Next, so you can mark it as first group and second group. This one is first group, this one is second group. 64, it is first group, 1, 7, otherwise 17 is the second group. Like that way. Next step important step 64 its unit place is 4 so just to check in this squares where unit place 4 is there that you have to check it so 2 square is 4 8 square is 64 unit place 4 here unit place 4 two options are there for getting 4 2 square 4 is there, 8 square 4, 64 is there, both place, unit place is a 4 itself. So, 2 options are there, that options you can write here, that is a 64 for getting 4, 2 options, one is 2, another one is 8, that you keep it there. Send it, 2, 8, these are the options. Next, you can take the second group. We have to find the square root of 1764, second group we can take 17. Just to find out uh, what is the perfect square number nearest 17. Nearest 17, what is the perfect square number? So, below, send it, uh, below 17, that we have to find out. So, below 17, nearest perfect square number. We know that uh, that number is 16. 16 is the perfect square number nearest 17. Otherwise, below 17, that is the perfect square number. Just to find out its a square root, uh, we know that it is 4. Okay, so in answer, two digit number will come. In that uh, first digit, otherwise, uh, tens place is a uh, four, you can write. Tens place is a uh, four. Unit place, we can find out. Uh, for that, uh, this option you can take. Uh, that is, here we got four. It's a successor, you find out. Four and it's a successor. Four and successor is five. That you multiply together. Four into five is equal to 20 will come. So, here this number otherwise second group is 17 and the multiplication number is uh, 20. So, this 17 is uh, less than 20. We know that uh, this 17 is uh, less than 20 otherwise second group number is uh, less than this product. Uh, you have to take a smaller number. If uh, this group is greater than this number, you have to take a greater number, that is the method. So, here uh, 17 is uh, smaller than 20, therefore a uh, smaller number you have to take. Uh, so, you can, can write here 42, otherwise 42. So, square root of 1664 is a uh, 42. 2 will come 1764 is a 42. This is the method. Okay. I will give a one more example. Another example we will do. 
okay so we'll get to the idea little more so another example is uh, 7056 we have to find out the uh, square root of 7056 we have to find out this value so first step uh, you have to make the group so in that group uh, like this way we can draw it so here are uh, first group and the uh, second group first group uh, second uh, group okay so we have to find uh, the square root of uh, 7056 First step, you need to place 6. So, which squares in this group, which numbers are there for getting the number 6, you need to place 6. So, here 6 is there, here you check it, here 6, here 6. So, 4 and 6, that numbers you have to write here, 4, 6, 2 options are there. Send it, 4 square is equal to 16, you need to place 6, 6 square is equal to 36, you need to place 6, 2 options are there. Okay, anyway, so that you give it there. We will get a two digit number that will be the answer. Send it anyway. Send two digit number, two digit number only will come. Send it to four digit square root of four digit, always two digit number will come. Okay, next step I have already told to take a second group. Second group nearest perfect square number. Otherwise, here second group is 70 below 70, which is the perfect square number. Below 70 perfect square number, we know that it is 64. Square root of 64 you find out uh, it is 8. Send it to square root of 64 is uh, 8. So 8 you can write here. That is a uh, tens place always uh, in answer tens place 8 will come. Next uh, 8 uh, it's a successor. So 8 uh, into successor is 9 otherwise uh, next uh, number generator that is a uh, 9. 8 into 9. 8 into 9 is equal to 72. Send it 8 into 9 is equal to 72. Check it out. Uh, 70 and here 72. 70, 72. 70 is uh, smaller than 72. 70 is a smaller. 70 is a smaller. Smaller means smaller number we have to take. Smaller number is 4. So 84 you can write. So answer is uh, 7050. So a root of 7056 is equal to 84 will come. This is the method to find the square root of a number. Okay. One more example we can do. Okay. Four digit number. After that, uh, five digit number also we can find. Square root of uh, another number I am taking 9604. Send it 9604. Another number it is. We have to find the square root of this number. Just make the group. First group uh, 0, 04 is there. First group. Second group uh, 96 is there. Okay, 0, 04. You need to place 4, just check it out. Where 4 is there? Here, here. So 2, 8 will come. So write down here 2, here 8. Next step, 96. Second group, 96. Nearest 96. Otherwise, below 96, which is the perfect square number. Below 96, perfect square number is 81. Square root of 81 is 9. So here, answer is always 2 digit number. The 2 digit number. Tens place is 9. We got it. Tens place is 9. Next number we have to find out for that uh, is uh, multiply 9 into its successor. Otherwise, uh, next number. Okay. Here consecutive, next consecutive. Send it. So here it is 9 into 10. 9 into 10 is equal to 90. Send it. 9 into 10 is equal to 90. So here 96. Here 90. 96 is uh, greater than. 90 this one is a greater number than 90 96 is greater so greater number we have to take 96 greater so greater number so 8 is the greater number so 98 will come so answer is a 96 a very simple method to find the square root of a number this one is four digit number we will do one a five digit number also okay So one of five digit number we can take the same method we can use there also 16384 so 16384 that we can write 16384 so 16384 the same method first make the groups first two digit otherwise tens place unit place one group remaining numbers 163 remaining numbers so first group 84 second group 163 Okay, these are the groups. So in that 84, first group 84, you need to place the 4 is there. So here you check it out where you need to place the 4, 4 and 64, number 2 and 8. So 2, 8 you can write 2 and 8. Next up. 
here 163 is there 163 send it one number we have to write here another number it is not two digit three digit will come okay so 163 nearest 163 below 163 which is the perfect square number below 163 perfect square number is 144 so write 144 just to find its square root of we know that it is 12 so that number you can write here 12 send it in the first blank place you can write 12 next number we have to find out for that 12 into its consecutive otherwise its successor that is 13 multiplied together you will get it 156 send it 12 into 13 is equal to 156 check it 163 is greater than 156 163 greater than 163 greater than 156 greater than then greater number that is 8 so 128 square root of 16384 is a 128 will come this one is the answer 128 simplest method to find the square root of uh, this type of numbers any number you can check it uh, perfect square numbers non perfect square numbers for finding the square root another method is there after that uh, in another class i will discuss send it you just do this problems using some different numbers uh, take some different uh, perfect square numbers you just to find out the answers using this uh, shortcut uh, method okay we will see in next video till then bye